Hey guys, this is Sedil65 coming at you with a Let's Build. Today we'll be, we will be building a, um, a compact fishing house. And so let's get started. Um, you will need all these things I have in my inventory, so you can just quickly pause the video and take a look at what I have. Okay. So, um, yeah, you will at, the fir at first need all these things. I'm just trying to, you know. Okay, so um, what I did is I took, I found the little pool or a pond or something, and I uh, got started. So that's t your first blocks, um, and that's how much you want to build. What you want to do here now, oh, whoopsies. You also need this oak wood slabs for so for a lot of stuff. Okay, so that's what you that's what you need to do, and you put it on the other side as well. Whoa, messed that up. Okay. So then you build up like that. Put that there. Now, the reason I call this a fishing hut is because it's right in front of the thing and I made it in such a way that you can you can take your fishing pole and sit down right there. Whoa, like you could sit down right there and um, you know, just fish. Okay, so that's the front of your house. Now, um, what you want to do is you take your oak wood planks and you go one out, two out, then you go one, two, three, four, five. Okay, now you do the same on the other side. One, two, three, four, five. Sorry for the noise in the background. So that's what you want to do. Now um, you will be putting something right there. So what you want to do is dig down. Okay, and we'll get back to that later. So you need to do is right here you go that do that that whoopsies that and that 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 and that now just copy the pattern all around the place so that would what get out of here no I said get out die I just gotta kill this pig, 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 pig. References. Okay, um. So, once you've got. Oh, messed that up. Once you got that laid out, then what you just wanna do, just, you know, go all around the sides. Laying down your oak wood planks. So this is the inside of your house, but will which will be there. Um, so what you want to do is at the moment grab your. Uh, Fences, just uh, do that, you know, small, really cool, compact windows.
Whoa. What? Just happened. Okay. So, um, now that you've got that done, go over to this side and start placing some of this stuff right here. Just grab this and this quickly. You want to put one of that there, one of that there. I want to place that there. Wait a second. No. I want to place this here. Oh, yeah. You might want to uh, fix that if you're following along with me. You want to do the same thing on the other side. Now, uh, this will be... Wait a second. Well, anyways. Once you've done that, you can put those pressure plates on top of there. Get rid of that. Bookshelves. Oh. Forgot about that. Wait, no. I don't think I put that there in my practice. So, anyways. You might want to... This is where we're going to be placing the beds. So what you want to do is go over here, dig, put that there, that there. What you want to do right here, whoa, yeah. What you want to do here is uh, put that there, put that there. And I don't think we need at the moment that. We do that there. All right. Place your bed first, and then destroy that, and put down your chests. Okay. So you can only you can do this if you're, um, you know either by yourself or with another person in survival mode. But uh, I like I always like having two beds just in case and or ha and putting two chests there so that at all times you will have uh, storage. And so you can just put your I don't think I did that. Well, anyways, you just put your storage there. Now we'll get done with the rest of this part just like this okay so what you want to do here just to make it a bit better like that. And then all you have to do here is just place your open planks as the roof. Legs terrible here. Now I'm on a single player map. Place your torch there, torch there. Torch there, and torch there. No, just keep placing. Okay. So, now what you want to do is actually get down here now. So, now that you've done that, you want to stand here and dig two that way, two that way, and I believe two that way. So, if I'm right, that would create, if you dig out everything else, 
a 4 by 5 place. And that's what you're going to have for your uh, stuff. So now here's where awesomeness comes in. Those, these are like support beams for the infrastructure. Lake City here. Well, if you are my viewers, who frankly aren't that many, uh, I'm sorry for, I apologize for the lag. Um, I'm hoping to, on um, getting a new computer someday. It's just that my computer is really old. So, yeah, T to raise the ceiling just a bit, you want to, uh, you know, just place oak wood slabs that, that uh, pours out the beams just a bit more. Now, what this basement is for is um, you technically really don't need this basement, but I use it in my builds for extra storage or um, anything. You can do anything with here. You can build it like you can actually. This doesn't have to be your basement. You can have the top really, really uh, classic and have the bottom so modern that people won't even notice that, that people are so confused about everything redstone you know but for now we're just going to be putting down regular stuff here that up again. What do you know? There we go. Uh, now, to finish your basement, just place down some torches. And your ladder. There you go. Oh, now I remember. Last thing that you have to make sure of. Put your uh, trap doors right there and there. And put your crafting tables right there. There. So, um, now you have all that cool stuff. Now, um, on the outside, this is how it will look like. I know, it looks compact and uh, small, and that's one of the things I like about Minecraft. You can make things gigantic and huge, or you can th make things look uh, small and unmodern and unadvanced, and it will still look good. So you guys, um, thanks for watching to see you in the next video. Whoa. Um, but yeah, thanks. See you guys. Bye.